Hey, my name is Justin Evans, and I'm the weird guy at the 5K, talking into a camera before it starts. <laughs> so I'm at a 5K. Can't believe it. Cannot believe it. It's called the Las Vegas Fat Man 5K. I don't know if you see it. Las Vegas Fat Boy 5K. And uh, it's kind of a different kind of 5K. There's some people that should not be at a Fat Boy 5K right now. It's like they're training for the Olympics or something. No, I'm just kidding. It's just a 5K. That's what it is. That's what I'm doing. I've been uh, training for this, I guess, since October. Uh, when I started running in October, I uh, Googled. It's a search engine uh, for those of you who aren't familiar with Google. Um, I, I tried to find a um, run that I could do in February or March, and I found this one. And uh, it said Las Vegas Fat Boy 5K, and I said, I'm in. I'm in. So uh, it starts in about an hour. I'm nervous. I could actually vomit right now. I'm so nervous. Literally, I'm, I, I don't know why I'm nervous. I guess I've just never ran in something like this before, so I guess that's why I'm nervous. But um, it starts, and I'm going to bring you along with you. It starts in like an hour, and I'll bring you along with me, and I'll bring you, I'm going to bring you along with me. I'm going, I, I don't know who I am or where I am right now. I can't feel my hands. Just kidding. But at the end of this 5K, um, they, they have like sausage, beans and rice, donuts, um, bagels, all the things you shouldn't eat because um, it's a Fat Boy 5K. So I'm kind of excited about that. <laughs> I fall off the wagon at the end of a 5K. That'd be awesome. No, but I'm excited. So we'll see. You know, it's going to be fun. And uh, I'm really nervous, but uh, it'll be over soon. Something I failed to mention. See this cool shirt I'm wearing right now? Whoop. You've probably seen it before. Um, I took a photo. This shirt's been a huge like motivational tool for me. I took a photo a while ago when I was about 320 pounds in this shirt. So, so as I've lost weight, I've worn this shirt every now and then when I've done runs or whatever, and uh, it just keeps fitting looser and looser. So um, they gave us really cool Las Vegas Fat Boy 5K shirts that a lot of people are wearing today, but I didn't want to run. I didn't want to wear that. I'll show you the shirt later though, it's really cool. Um, but I didn't want to wear that, I wanted to wear this because this is such a cool motivational thing for me and uh, that's why I'm sporting it. And by the end of the day, it's gonna be really, really, really sweaty and I can't wait. spotted my wife and son uh, they're playing on the swings over here but uh, that was one of the most exhilarating experiences of my life I cannot I cannot believe it my first mile was right at eight minutes I haven't ran an eight-minute mile forever but I finished in 2801 5k 2801 you did it. You did it. come here bud where's my victory hug Where's my victory hug? So I finished it. I told you they had red beans and rice and a sausage and hot dogs and stuff in here. So I'm gonna check this out. Boom. Boom. So Cassie and I are gonna Cassie and I are gonna get a little lunch now. But uh, I gotta thank this lady here for supporting me in my running. Oh, I feel bad. It's kind of it's fine. It was kinda of hard. It was, it was kinda of hard to know where it was. It's all good. But uh she puts up with me running and uh, watches Baby Johnny so I can run. Sometimes it's as long as an hour. Well, more than that with like getting ready and stuff. So thank you to my sweet wife for letting me do stuff like this. And now we're gonna eat. We're gonna get our eat on. What a cool experience, guys. That was so awesome. Oh, I told you earlier that I'd show you the shirt that uh, they have, that they handed out for the 5K. Here it is, ready? So we got Elvis. Las Vegas Fat Boy 5K and uh, oh, Fat Elvis with a donut. And at the end, like I showed you, they had sausages, beans and rice, donuts. I didn't eat a donut. I wanted to, but I did. And uh, coconut water. For those that drink beer, they had beer and uh, all sorts of stuff. It was really cool. Good experience. So a lot of fun. And I plan on doing another 5K this summer, likely in Idaho. So we'll see how that goes and where it takes me. And uh, just again, thank you for the support. Um, those of you who watch regularly uh, have been a huge, and Cassie mentioned this the other day, a huge driving force in my success because the days that I'm like, oh, I really don't want to run, I just think, oh crap, 
the people on YouTube that watch us are going to hold me accountable, so I, uh, I've stuck with it. But more than that, even if you don't have a YouTube channel, even if you don't make videos every day, um, there are people in your circle who can encourage you, and a lot of my encouragement has come from my wife, my mom, um, people that I know every know and see every day. And here's the thing: um, when I started running, I didn't see the pounds fall off for a while. I mean, it took a while to start seeing weight shed, and initially, I didn't get that the excitement and the thrill and the satisfaction of losing weight. So the uh, encouragement and the motivation and the instant gratification that I needed came from my wife and my mom and others in my life. Because I would just say, hey, I just ran a half mile, hey, I just ran a mile, hey, I just ran for this long. And they offered support. They offered encouragement. They offered the, wow, that's so awesome, I can't believe you did that. That was the instant gratification that I needed, just because I'm the type of person I am, um, to keep going and just keep pushing. And uh, since October, I had this 5K in mind, and uh, it was a huge motivator just to keep going, keep pushing, because I wanted to do it. And I did it, and uh, from the bottom of my heart, thank you for the support.